welcome back to the channel guys this week is going to be a quick unboxing video from a gift i have just received in the post so a couple of weeks ago <coughs> there was a video on jackie's channel she did a live giveaway for her 1000 subscribers um, and gaining monetization and one of the first prizes was a box of 10 chromatus which was gifted to Jackie by Mel and Terry of M&T Tarantulas um, lovely couple and Osman uh, OC Tarantulas won that and kindly donated the 10 chromatus to me now since then things have spiraled a little bit um, and basically the 10 chromatus never um, managed to be shipped for one reason or another um, we won't worry about going into the reasons why um, but what Terry's done is Terry's been chatting to me back and forth for a few weeks talking about um, changing up what was in the box a little bit and making the the gift a, a little bit special because obviously there's been a bit of a wait and a bit of a disruption with it so the box is here I haven't opened it the only thing I've done is remove my address um, and what we're going to do is we're going to shift the camera over to the desk and we'll unbox it together and we'll see what's in there i have no idea on how many spiders or what spiders are in here so it's going to be interesting let's move the camera okay so we've got the box on the desk i've got to try and see where the seal is on this one as you can see i've not touched this at all so it's going to be interesting to see what we've got in here there's been lots of discussion about spiders I have what spiders I don't have and etc etc so I'll have to try and open all this packaging without destroying the box too much just so whatever's in there doesn't get hugely disturbed without going through my fingers, that'd be nice. Right, we hope you enjoy your friends, enjoy ours from m &T. So, let's have a look and see. Nice personalized box. Good packaging so far. Box looks nice and solid. Right, what have we got inside? Right, a couple of M&T Tarantula stickers, nice, a couple of stickers, the calling card for all their social media platforms, TikTok, Instagram and Facebook. Thank you for purchasing from M&T. Right, let's have a look inside. And yes, I did catch my thumb on the knife, brilliant. Right, good packaging, really nice packaging. Let's think the spiders are actually inside the bubble wrap. Yeah, they are. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse my coughing, guys. Right, let's have a see what we've got in here then. So, we have Sour Pierce Ammonia, another Sour Pierce Ammonia. These are the ones, the Ammonias, I believe, are the ones that were replacing the Chromatus in general. Another Sour Pierce Ammonia, so that's three of those so far. Another Sour Pierce Ammonia. These are the Sun Tiger. Gorgeous looking spider. I don't actually have any of those. So that's four. And another Ammonia, which brings a total of five Ammonias. Okay, let's have a look what else we've got in here. Syrogopacopus Hattie Hattie, which is the Purple Earth Tiger. Awesome spider. That's cool. And 
another Cirrhopagopus hatty hatty, which means danger, danger. Um, purple earth tiger, beautiful spider, beautiful spider. Then, oh, this one's special. Pocotheria ornata. This is one I do not have. Um, I do like the pokies, and the ornata is an amazing looking spider. So this is uh, very special. So thank you very much for that, that's awesome. Uh, next up, oh wow. So this is the Pocotheria Safrusca lowland. Now, there is a lot of controversy as to whether the lowlands are actually a thing in the hobby, but if it is, this is absolutely fantastic. What a brilliant spider. So I don't have one of those, and it'll be interesting to watch this one grow. So we've got to try and find houses for that one, that's for sure. And then I believe, lastly in here, oh wow, Harpactera pogpies. This is the golden blue leg baboon. Um, and golden blue leg baboon, I do have one, uh, which is a sling, grown on sling, but this one, uh, what Terry was saying to me, out of the egg sack that they've got, um, this one I did know was going to be in here, and it's growing a lot slower than the other ones out of the sack. So this one could be female, maybe, depending on the fact that it's molting a lot, lot slower than others in the egg sack. It could just be genetics, but who knows. Fingers crossed for a female on this one, though. And I believe... Have a dig through the undergrowth. I believe that is everything out of the box. So let's have a quick review, shall we? So we have the five sour pierce ammonia, Harpactera pogpies, the Safrusca lowland uh, pokey, an ornata pokey, and two Cirriopagopus hatty hatties. Honestly, this considering what this was going to be as part of the giveaway um, what an unbelievable change of um, spiders so I will be giving Osman a good look through these to see which ones if any he would like out of the out of this box um, but all I've got to say is uh, thank you very much to Mel and Terry um, I know it's taken a little while to sort out but I know that the, the reasons you were doing that I know you were holding on um, waiting for certain ones to become large enough to be able to ship and stuff like that so thank you so so much this box is unbelievable packaged really really well um, and from the looks of the spiders these are actually sealed quite well as well in here I will have a good old look through and make sure everything's okay before I close the video out um, but yeah as far as I can see the box is brilliant quick delivery really good communication if you've got any spiders you want to have a look at I'd go and check out M&T tarantulas on one of their social media platforms absolutely awesome so yeah that is the uh, mystery box uh, from um, M&T tarantulas Mel and Terry awesome people uh, sort of spoke to Terry on and off for a while uh, really nice couple um, I did rehouse them all uh, I've taken them all out of those little pots they arrived in and the ammonias have all gone into sling vials with a bit of cork bark um, five of them Four of them went in absolutely calm as anything. The first one I thought was going to uh, be the sign of everything to come, but luckily it was the only one that gave me the runaround. Um, absolute nightmare. Uh, it did get out of the uh, box that it was in as a trapment box, and then the second box that it was in, it got out of that one as well. I ended up having my hand cupping it around the outside uh, just to hold it still while I moved into a more appropriate spot to uh, rehouse that one. So, yeah, that was... That was uh, good way to get your heart rate up in the morning um, I just want to say thank you a huge amount to both Mel and Terry um, I, I know this box has sort of come sort of had a little, little bit of a delay but they wanted to make sure that what they were giving was um, perfect and I have to say that it was it's more than perfect it's very very gratefully received and I'm going to be paying the generosity forwards the H Polk peas the uh, two pokies and the two hatty hatties are larger than I thought they would be. Uh, sellers always amaze me when they actually manage to get some of those spiders into those tiny little tubs. And then when you take off the tissue, their legs come out and they're just absolutely huge. So yeah, they're, they're quite large. But what we've got is we've got a situation where I have a few, couple of hatty hatties and uh, a few amernias, a few curly hairs and a few camera guy that I will grow on for a little while 
and then once they are, are a nice established size I will be gifting them out to some subscribers uh, not sure how I'm going to do it yet um, but that is the plan they can't all stay here I have too many so I will grow them on I'll give them some love give them some feeds make sure they're doing okay and then uh, we'll figure something out we'll figure something out to pass it forward uh, generosity is always a, a nice thing to sort of give to other people so when it's received I think you should always try and um, do something nice for someone else so that's what we're going to do anyway if you did enjoy this unboxing um, please give the video a thumbs up and if you're not subscribed please consider doing so I think next week we possibly have a slightly different video it's either going to be a rehousing or a trip um, out for the day not sure what's coming yet so we'll see anyway if you enjoy it please like please subscribe leave a comment they're always welcome and I'll catch you on the live tonight